that is the view just outside my room. Good morning. Uh, I think my Uber's already here. Hello, hello. I'm in a rush. I've got to get to the airport. <gasps> Focus. That's what I need to be doing today. Focusing. I've got to get to Dallas today. And this is my room, just in case you haven't seen. There's my bed, which I've been sleeping in the last few days. It's a very nice room here at the Double Tree in Newark, New Jersey. And the, uh, the bathroom, which is lovely. Because we are leaving New Jersey. <laughs> Welcome to Dallas. We've arrived, the city of Dallas, here in the southern state of Texas. Howdy. Uh, I'm gonna go and look for who shot JR because uh, it's quite important after all these years. My money is probably on Ellen White. She's around here somewhere. I think she did it. Um, I might try and uh, get her to confess at some point this week, over the next few days. Uh, but right now, I'm gonna go and get my bag because I need that. Just in the Uber at the minute, just on my way to the West End in, in Galeria, uh, or Galleria, I think it's known as. I've been saying Galeria, like a tourist. And uh, that's where the England Team Hotel are. That's where we're going to be doing our very last, very final media day of this tournament. The weather here in Dallas is very all over the place, uh, temperature wise that is, because at the moment it's 12 degrees, uh, it's pretty chilly out, and by about 2 or 3 o'clock it's going to be about 25 degrees, so it's going to double within just a few hours, which is uh, pretty strange from where we come from of course, over in England, because it doesn't dramatically change like that. Jill, how's it going? Yeah, good, good. Um... I, d I can't believe we're nearly at the end of the tournament, actually. But yeah, obviously disappointing result against USA, but it was yeah. really good to get that win against Japan, and it means that it's all to play for in that last game. It's been an amazing tournament so far. I mean, the experience of coming out to the US has been wicked, hasn't it? Yeah, yeah. Um, I love America. I think it's such um, such a fantastic country and amazing places to see. Uh, we we're in Orlando and then New York and then here in Dallas, so it's great to obviously tick them places off your, your list of places to go and see, but we know that we're here to do a job, so we haven't had a lot of time to get out sightseeing, but that's what we're here to do, play football. Most definitely. Did you pack your Stetson? <laughs> do you know what a Stetson is? No. I was, gonna, <laughs> yeah. I was just going to laugh and pretend that I did. I but, noticed. I was like, I'm not getting, letting you yeah. get away with that one. What is it? It's a hat, a cowboy a hat. hat. No, I haven't brought a that's, cowboy hat. That's what hat. you need to be doing. Yeah. You should have been bringing something know, like that. I know, I should have, actually. You Ooh. know what? We'll probably miss um, Karen Bardsley on this trip for, for that. Oh, of course. Stuff. Yeah, so carrying, she, she would have been fantastic. Carrying an injury, but she's the one that usually brings stuff like that. Okay, so we're going to do a really quick quick fire quiz, uh -huh. all right, on Texas oh. and see how well you do on this one, all I'm right? so bad at stuff like this. <laughs> well, let's see. Let's find out. Okay, so the first thing, what film is this from? There's a snake in my boots. Oh, um, Toy Story. Oh, there you go. So you're on one. Perfect. Okay. The Dallas what are an American football team? Oh, I should know this. The Dallas Cowboys. Yes, you're two for Is two. It? There you go. Cowboys. There you go. You made it up. <laughs> well, maybe they did at the time. They're like, what's, what's that makes sense yeah, for Texas? Yeah, I didn't. I'm not taking the whole uh, quiz for that. <laughs> two for two. All right, number three. What are the Dallas hockey team known as? A bit more tricky, this one. Do I get a multiple choice? Oh, God, you're pushing See, it, aren't you? you? You're pushing Come it. Come on, now you've got to think. Multiple just choice. Give us two. Okay, think of. Us. I was just, I'm going to make myself look really thick yeah. here. Think of um, astronomy. Astronomy? I nearly said astrology, which oh. is something completely different. Is it? Oh, right, because I Astrology is uh, star signs. Right, you're trying to get me out of here. 
Um, astronomy, <laughs> the Nornas, the stars. Oh, well done. Three for three. Are you joking? <laughs> no, no, no. Honestly, you're doing really well. I I'm helping you out a little bit. Off. No, it's honestly, the okay. Dallas hockey team are known as the stars. I just looked it up myself. Okay. All right. Um, what is, what's the Texas tie known as? Texas what? Tie. Have you seen the tie? You know, they have that little string tie oh, that they wear. Okay. Do you know what that's known as? That's a tricky one. I didn't know this either. Just a no, minute ago. No, I'm going to have to pass. Okay, that's the first one you've passed. That's known as um, a bolo. Oh, or a bolo, bolo, that. okay. So there's only one wrong you've got. Um, and then uh, you've got one final okay. one, okay. Actually, there's two technically, but okay. the final one is, uh, what's a uh, cowboy hat known as? Oh, you've just told us, haven't you? Yeah, yeah, I did, yeah. This, oh, I can't remember This, the, uh, oh, what did you say? Let me know what Jill's memory's like. Yeah, I'm very forgetful. And how attentive she is. I am very forgetful. The Stetson. Stetson. All right, and then give me your best uh, southern accent. Oh, I can't do accents, I'm rubbish. What, like just an American accent? A, t a southern accent. You go, We're then in... I'll copy. I just did when I said, Whoever. there's a snake in my boots. Okay. There's a snake in my boots. Oh, yours was better than mine. There better you not can... be a snake in my boots for training. No, no, I was a bit no. worried I might see a yeah. rattlesnake um, yeah. earlier. I think you should be quite happy with yeah, that. The I Texans would be really chuffed with you for that. Yeah. So, and um, I think that I've worked out who shot JR. Do you remember the whole Dallas thing? There was a, there was a soap back in the day called Dallas. Remember oh, that? Right, okay. Have you ever heard of who shot JR? No, go on, tell us. Well, I think it's Ellen White. <laughs> And I'm going to get her to confess. Yeah. This has been an ongoing thing for about 30 years or 40 years now. That would actually be a good, good interview, to be honest. Yeah, get I need to strikers, get her to confess. So get please. our strikers and see who was it. Yeah, okay. go out and find out and, and do me a little thing. And maybe I'll catch up with you on, uh, on, on Wednesday after we win. Okay. And uh, then you can, you can let me know. Get her to confess. Let's do it. Be good. Okay. Have a good one tomorrow. Thank you. Thanks a lot. <laughs>the Toyota Stadium in Frisco, Texas. It is wow, it's hot, 29 degrees, final day of the She Believes Cup. England is up first against Spain. Later on, it will be US versus Japan to decide the She Believes Cup 2020. England shirt for this day is 1982 from Spain, funny enough. Let's hope this is a, an omen, but a good omen. I'm not sure. We didn't do too great in the 1982 World Cup, but it's a lovely shirt nonetheless. Steve Hopper here for Cheeky Sport once again. I'll tell you what, you need the sun cream out here today because it is stifling. The perfect stadium here in Frisco in Texas for such a wonderful event. The final day of the She Believes Cup. And my prediction, I haven't really thought too much about this, but I'm going to go with my instinct once again. I hate to say it, but I think it's going to be a stalemate one all between England and Spain. This isn't good. I've just uh, spotted a couple of players on crutches. One of them is Beth England. So I'm here with Dre. Dre, how are you? I'm good, how are you? <laughs> I'm really well, we're here, it's the sunny, I've got insects covering, yeah. all, covering on me. What's the score going to be today? Give me a prediction. Good one, please. Oh, uh, I'm going... 2-0 England, of course. I, I like know. it, I, I want that, that to be. Frisco, 3-0. 3-0. Three nil. Three nil. She shouted over on purpose then, because she didn't... That was biased. Here we go. Here comes Paris. Let's see what she can do here. Brilliant ball. Oh. And it's in again. Oh, oh come on, referee. Oh. Oh, dear. Hope you're supporting England over there. Keep moving, keep moving. Keep moving. Yes, Ellen White's on. Oh, very, very close. Keeper was out fast. Best seat in the house. Sat here. 
look like a nasty one on Nikita there. I've just met my new best mate from here in America. What was your name? John and and John has just John and uh, Lucy. Lucy. This is this is Lucy, who is uh, Lucy Bronze's number one fan out, out here in the states. How's it going, Lucy? You good? And uh, and John's just told me that there's a British pub just outside the stadium and hopefully they'll do roast and I haven't had a roast for a couple of weeks and maybe a bit of roast chicken or roast beef some spuds oh I'm salivating parsnip mashed potatoes mint sauce cranberry jelly cheese pigs in blanklets oh sweet right I'm back I'm back with football we're gonna get an England chant going on right now and what we're gonna do let's see how brave you are we're gonna do <laughs> nah, 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 England. England! England! Keep going, I'm going to move past you. England. Let's see how far we can get this going. England! We want more, we want the whole stadium rocking just for one moment. Come on, come on, we've got to come on, keep going. For the USA hospitality, come on. Come on, England! <laughs> oh, she's on. It's going to be a goal. It's a goal. Oh, what a save! Well done, Carly. Brilliant. Incredible save by Carly Telford there. I thought that was in for sure. The roof will come off. It won't because there's no roof, but you get my, my meaning. Ping it. Oh, oh side net him. Side net, and I thought that was him. Get it out. Get what it out. Carly Telford again. Wow. Oh, it's him. Spain scored. Really good corner. Beautiful. Great header. You saw it coming from a mile off. It was just building and building and building. And uh... what do you think of the game? It was good. It was a hard game, hard fought game. We ran out of steam. You're used to the temperatures, I think, out in Spain. Yes. What, what did you think about the game, early the England game? It was good. It was good. It would have been better if they'd won. <laughs> what do you think of our mascot paws? He's very cute. I love him. We need something to cheer us up after this uh, difficult tournament. Quite an amazing view from up here. This is uh, known as the Winners Club. And, uh, well. Obviously, it speaks volumes, doesn't it? Why it's called the the Winners Club. What's your name? Cat. 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 You're you're uh, from the United States of America. I am indeed. Are you from Texas. I am. As a mark of unity, I think that we should swap hats. I can do that. Yeah. yeah. Should we? Yeah. I'll take yours, and you take mine. Oh. Oh. Yours is it your fit. Nice. Yeah. Mine doesn't fit at all. <laughs> this feels weird. You know why it feels weird? Because it's got. I mean, there's triple four now, but it's got three World Cup winners. That feels weird to me. Like, I mean, it's what I want. I want England to be, you know, doing success, but it feels like wrong. See y'all later. There you go. Uh, nice. With that noise, the sea, the US fans, Mega Rapino scores. What will probably be Mega Rapinos and the US is She Believes Cup for 2020. It's been a very tough tournament for England. It's been one hell of an experience for us traveling from Orlando up to New Jersey and back down to Texas. It would have been better to finish on a high with a few points in the bag, of course, and reach six points. We'll finish third. Very, very disappointing indeed. As I've been saying all tournament, it's one step backwards and two forwards. And hopefully we can reach the level that the US has reached with all their World Cups and their ball of stars around their own emblem. We have some work to do for Euro 2020 and also the Olympics later on the year. This is a very positive Steve Hopper for Cheeky Sports. Looking forward to the next couple of years. Oh, what did you see? Let me know what Jill's memory's like. I was 11, there was not a lot to know. So find your piece of heaven. Oh. Just watch them go away. What do you say? The kids goodbye to yesterday. This time will never get the best of
Judging by last year's World Cup, including large inflatable things. The yeah. Unicorns? Have we uh, packed them? I'm not sure. I don't know. I've not seen them yet. Freezing. In the States, the US of A for the She Believes Cup, Orlando, Florida. I've arrived in Newark, New York City. Welcome to Dallas, Austin, Texas. Okay, you're impressing me so far, so I'm intrigued. What else? That was okay, that was in sync. People watch them run away. What do you say? Come on, Goodbye to yesterday. See y'all later. So I'm outside. Wow. Do you like tea? When we were young, we had it all. Something deep inside. Hope you're supporting England over there. I got an itchy head. Sunlight of the sea. When we were young, we had it all. Something deep inside. Uh, love it, love it, love it. I've always wanted to do this. Taxi! Manhattan, please. Yes! This is outrageous. I think that was a typical Ellen Michael. And I've probably cracked a rib. Hey, y'all. Then we've got the bit between our teeth right now. It's called fried chicken. <laughs> yeah, can't wait. <laughs> we want the whole stadium rocking just for one moment. Come on, come on. Let's go, English. Oh, what a say. It's it. Young, we had it all. Who's gonna win the She Believes Cup this year? I think you are, sir. Well, I'm done talking to you now. Standing <laughs> in the sunlight of the sea. What, like, just in a moment, an accent? A, a southern accent. You go, then I'll copy. I just did when I said Love there's it. a snake in my boots. Okay. There's a snake in my boots. Oh, yours was better than mine. You better you not can... be a snake in my boots for training. No, no. When we were young, we had it all. It is not called soccer. <laughs> <laughs> it is called football. When we were young, our hearts. We invented it in England. <laughs> Have you ever heard of Blue Peter? No. No, okay. I've just spotted Megan Rapino. What's she doing here? <laughs> Finally, Megan Rapino, we meet at last. I'm in the wrong part of town. And then you end it with a come on England! Come, come on, on England! England.